final lap now. Closing stages of the race, Steve Bate. Now keep in mind the world record, his own world record is 408.146. So can he topple that again? He set that earlier in the day. Here's the finish. 408.631, just outside by half a second, but they've won it by over a second. Gold medal to Steve Bates and Great Britain. You get an early indication, well, she's going very, very fast indeed. It was an excellent start by her in. Well, this is the question. Is she going to challenge Jamie Paris for the gold medal? She's more than a second faster at this point. Her Yin on her second lap. The Chinese athlete so popular here in London. The crowd really urging her on. What can she do? 40, that is another world record. Goodness, the records are falling all over the place. So poor Jamie Paris. Well, she set a world record, but with a factored time, 39.158. Her Yin has smashed that record by three quarters of a second. And what a result for the Chinese. Look at him frank it now, Mendes Fernandez. Trying to gain speed, he is a little off the pace, but don't forget he will have a factored time as he is a C1 rider. Yes, indeed, there will be uh, quite a chunk taken off his time as a result in that factored time. So it's not as wide a margin as you would think. Although it is starting to blow out here at 8.1 seconds off the time to beat, which is 59.084. So let's see, it does look as though Mendes Fernandez is a little fatigued. It is a very busy schedule here at the Rio Games and he's grimacing there. The deficit has blown out to 10 seconds as he rounds into the final straight. The time to look for 112.583. So let's get that factored time. It's 122.236. So that uh, puts Juan Jose Mendez Fernandez in fourth position. The slimmest of margins riding themselves into first position. They're on the hunt for a medal, this pair. Well, Emma Foy, she started paracycling in 2013, but uh, she believes as she reflects that the sport of cycling has always been in her blood and that uh, it's been a life in the making, being a cyclist. Well, this is a big moment for her. The New Zealanders have already set a benchmark. 111.075 is the time to beat, and they're in front now. So they're first and third New Zealand. Emma Foy and Laura Thompson are now well and truly in contention for a medal, a terrific ride.